And from the English West Midlands, we find ourselves at Molyneux. I'm your match commentator, Derek Ray, at the microphone. And sitting alongside me is the former Arsenal, West Ham and Coventry midfield player, Stuart Robson. And it's all about action from the Premier League in this case. It's Wolverhampton Wanderers. Chance here! And not cleared away properly! Crossing possibilities. Joel Linton. Oh, did so well to deny him. <laughs> and over comes the corner. Half-hearted clearance. On the ball, Chavez. Robinson. It's a perfect challenge. Well, sometimes we look for an explanation and just can't find one, but the truth of the matter is Liverpool have been well below par. Well, what a poor season they're having. I really thought they would be challenging for the title. There just seems to be something wrong with oh, the sorry, attitude. Oh, sorry, Stuart, look at this. Oh, that is a superb save. Well, can they be creative from here? And a goal! Not bad for starters. They take an early lead. Well, here it is again, and it's all about the pace in transition. They're so quick to get out from the back, and it makes the striker's job so easy. All he has to do is make the right connection. It's a lovely goal. So the action continues, and it's on Wolves to show invention and perhaps level the game. Gonzalo Getsch. Sarabia. And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. Now well, they've given him too much space. Oh, it comes to nothing in the end. Really should have made more of that. Fulham recovering possession well. What can they do from here? Options in the centre. Joao Linton. Nicely blocked. Now, well, breaking at pace is always a possibility. And a timely intervention. Did really well to get through. Oh, genuine chance. He can't hold on to it. And he gobbles up the second chance. Disappointment for the keeper. No wonder he's asking questions of his defence. Well, here it is again, and I feel a bit sorry for the goalkeeper. He makes a good save to start with, but where are his defenders following in? Instead, it's the attacker who's alert. He gets to the ball first, and it's a good finish. So underway again, and a 2-0 advantage here. Gonzalo Getsch. Well, what can they do to stop him running at them? Could pull one back here. Oh, tremendous reflex action there from the keeper. Well, he didn't have long to react, did he? But that's a top-class save, I have to say. And short it is. Very quick thinking there. Oh, 
And in with a real chance. Oh, surely. Oh, yes, a goal. Exactly what they were looking for. And he's come up with it. Well, here it is again, and it's all about the pace on the counter-attack. They were so quick to break out from their defensive positions, and when he gets onto it, he decides to go for power. It's a really emphatic finish, which gives the keeper no chance. Blistering first-half display, and just look at that score. Bueno. And on the ball, Sarabia. Is that again? Seemed to switch off for a moment, and now a throw in. Here it is now, a substitution. Max Ahrens. Joel Linton. And thumped away. Jean Rickner Bellegarde. And they need to get tighter. And credit is due for that good piece of defending. Ponsa. Plenty of support here. Prepare to take on the shot. And the ball is loose. Determined defending. Counter-attacking chance. We've had the official word. There will be a minimum of two added minutes. Wolves failing to keep the ball. Palinha. Well, the story of the first half has been written. It is half-time now here at Molyneux. Well, there's a good reason why we're highlighting him. He's really dominating in attack in this game, Stuart. Well, his skill level to go past defenders and get shots away has been excellent today. The only surprise, he's just got the one goal. Well, underway once more, and it's going to be fascinating to see what developments occur in the second half. And making his move inside. And it's two for him today. A masterful performance. The defenders unable to stop it. And this is turning into something of a rout. 4-0. Santiago Bueno. Chance here. A goal! He's dispatched it. Much to the sheer delight of the fans. Well, here's the goal again, and what a wonderfully weighted pass this is. While the movement in the box is equal to it, it's such good timing. What a goal.
Well, not too much defending going on in the grand scheme of things. 4-1. Max Ahrens. It is a decent-looking attack here. And this time it's in! Fabulous goal! And just look at the celebrations! Well, just look at his strength here. He holds off the challenge, he keeps his balance, and he finds the back of the net. It's a wonderful goal. A glut of goals. 5-1 it is. Well, make sure you join us for more Premier League action coming your way. It's Wolverhampton Wanderers taking on Chelsea. Well, Derek, I'm really looking forward to it. Always a great atmosphere in that stadium, and it should be an entertaining match. Very quick thinking there. And a goal has gone in at the Tottenham Hotspur Stadium. Here's Alex Scott with the details. Yes, it's a second goal for Spurs. It's all level again at 2-2 with 59 minutes gone. Alex, thank you very much. Matt Doherty. That is how to apply the pressure. For them unable to hold on to the ball. Gonzalo Gerdes. Real chance. Wonderful save by Bert Leno. Just a quick reminder, we have more action from the Premier League coming your way. It's Fulham taking on Leicester City. Genuine chance. And a goal! There he is at the double. They just can't subdue him. Well, let's look at this again, Derek, because the transition when the ball changes hands is so quick and his movement so clever. Once he gets onto it, there's only one thought in his head. Smash it as hard as possible. What a good goal. Well, that's just what he wanted. He has to be happy with this performance. They've been good today. And a scoring update to bring you from the Tottenham Hotspur Stadium. Who has found the net? Alex Scott. It's a third for Liverpool. They now lead 3-2 with 69 minutes played. Many thanks as ever, Alex. Gonzalo Gerdes. Gonzalo Gerdes. Tremendous defending to stonewall him. Well, the counter chance looks very real. Not really the ideal clearance. Well, that's a sad end to the attack. Wang Hee Chan. And they know they need to stop him. Could be. Oh, a moment of pure class. Had to catch it perfectly. And didn't he just? Well, here we can see it again. Look at the way he glides past the defender to create space for himself. And what a great finish it is. Struck with power and accuracy, certainly no stopping that. Consa. And Palinha with it. Spraying passes around, almost waiting for the opposition to make a mistake.
Just 10 minutes to go. So on the cusp of the final whistle, and the visitors very much in command, Stuart. Well, what an excellent performance this has been. They've had complete control for most of the game. And a goal here! There it is! They've done it! Well, just watch this again. A change of pace, a change of direction, and a decent finish. That's a very good goal. Well, he looks really pleased, doesn't he? His side have been really good today. It's a massive lead, and it's very hard to imagine them losing it now. Craig Jawson. Gonzalo Gerdes now. Gonzalo Gerdes. Cunha. Chance for Gonzalo Gerdes. An alert piece of defending. Alcaraz. Well, breaking at pace is always a possibility. And he's in. And both hands on it. Good goalkeeping. Mateus Cunha. And the referee is going to add on four added minutes. Gonzalo Gedge. And there it is. A goal. But will it be purely a consolation at this stage of the proceedings? They haven't been at the best. Well, I have to say, this is a really good goal. Just look how well balanced he is. He knows he's going to be under pressure, but he shows great composure to hit the target. Well, if you enjoy high-scoring contests, this has been the game for you. Esri Konsa. Back now to the goalkeeper. And so, the final whistle here. The visitors come out on top, Stuart. You're absolutely right, Derek. Their attacking play was excellent, full of energy and pace, and the midfield completely dominated the game. It was a great all-round performance. No two ways about it, he really has brought his influence to bear on the proceedings. Well, I have to say, that was impressive. Not just his goals, but his all-round play. He was excellent.